Hi, and welcome to Hawkman312 Comms, and we're going to be building a mountain settlement, starting with the bridge and small rural house. And so here I laid out my bridge, and I wanted it to be five wide, with a pillar on one side and a pillar on the other side, and a gap of three. And I also didn't want this to just be a boring bridge, so I wanted to have two arches, one on each side. So here I am laying that out. I decided it wasn't quite right, so I moved it out one and laid it out in a pattern of one, then two, then three, and then I put it all the way down. And I wanted to do the outside with some wood to give it more depth and kind of the set in, built up, old look. And then I take it over to the other side. And this bridge is completely solid all the way through. There's no hollow bits or anything. It's all built up and hefty. And that's something I really wanted to keep with the whole theme. I want it to look like it had been there a long time. I want it to look strong. In this middle part, I decided it didn't look quite right, so I just left it how it was in the first place, with the two pillars going right up the middle. Okay, so here I am, I'm going to start on the roof. And I didn't want this to just be a straight roof, so I kind of gave it an up and down. Um, it's just kind of an interesting pattern that I wanted to do to make it more interesting. And here I accidentally moved the entire middle part was over too, too, too far to the right, so I had to move that left. And um, if it's interesting to you, and it sounds like I'm in a closet, it's because I actually am, because I'm still trying to figure things out, and I figured that all my clothes hanging up in my closet would kind of absorb some of the sound, the white noise kind of thing, so I figured I'd try it just to see how it works out. And I wanted to have kind of a Nordic feel, so I add those big chronolations on the end there. And I couldn't decide where to put the light, so I added this really, really big, really Nordic looking thing and hung the lantern right on the end. So here's a big panoramic of the bridge in all its glory. Looks quite nice, quite nice in darkness. And so here we are, we're going to start on the rural house. And um, I just want to point out that I get a lot of my ideas from other YouTube, other YouTubers, such as Shin from the Ogscast, who I'm a big fan of, and also Jamzaboy, who's also, I'm also a big fan of his, and Sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong, I know your name is James, so. And, um, so some of these ideas may seem familiar to you, and that's why. I don't know if you've seen their videos or not, you probably have, but that's why. And now, I couldn't decide how I wanted to do the roof on this building because it's kind of a small building and the roof just seemed too large on everything that I tried and I actually would have made it out of a thatch texture but I'm using the default John Smith and I'm doing that because I want any of you to be able to build anything I build without having to have a special texture pack that only I own so I just want everyone to be able to share in these buildings.
I had to lower the whole roof by one block because it just seemed too high and too big. Now we move inside to do the interior, and I decided on a wood floor, and I added a table made out of a piston, and a chair made out of a stair step, and a sign. And then I added a chest, a blue banner, and a bed. And I decided there wasn't quite room for a stove on the inside or an oven on the inside, um, so I decided to put the furnace in one of those kind of outside, kind of looking... I think they use them in pizza parlors a lot, like the old New York grilled pizzas. So I decided to put one of those outside. thought it looked quite good. And uh, I actually wanted to put another rack on the inside, but it didn't quite work. So I took it out. Uh, anyways, thanks for watching, and please comment on this, because I'm just starting out, and I want to know what I'm doing right and what I'm doing wrong. And I apologize if it's not exactly first class. I'm still trying to work things out. I'm new to this. So, that's why. Anyways, have a good rest of the day. This has been Hawkman312, signing off.